Fox News reporter Matt Petrillo is live at the scene in Kensington with more on this horrible crash. Good afternoon, Matt. Hey, Jim, good afternoon to you. Police tell us that vehicle was traveling more than 100 miles an hour when it slammed into the Allegheny Septa station. On the ground, though, there were no skid marks, police say. No attempt of that driver trying to stop before that crash. You can see what used to be a turnstile here is now boarded up after that turnstile was ripped from its frame, and a cell phone camera captured the immediate aftermath of the deadly crash. He jumped this jaw right here. It went straight into that zone, bro. Like 80 miles per hour. Like 80 miles per hour. Bystanders are seen rushing to that SUV to help. The crash happened just after 2.45 this morning here at Kensington and Allegheny Avenues. Police in the area reported seeing that SUV traveling eastbound on Allegheny Avenue before crossing over Kensington, jumping the curb and striking a turnstile before finally stopping after crashing into the building. The driver, who is a man, was pronounced dead on scene along with two other people who were outside the station. A 53 a year old passenger in the SUV was transported to the hospital in stable condition. Take a listen to how one witness described the horrifying crash. You know, I was standing across the street and a guy came through the intersection doing about, I don't know, maybe 100 miles an hour or better. And um, I saw him hit the median, jump over the median, and crash into the wall. Fortunately, this entire incident was captured on police real time crime cameras several angles. You can clearly see the vehicle traveling eastbound on Allegheny Avenue, and it appears to be traveling at a very high rate of speed. Eyewitness News also captured the SUV being towed away from the scene this morning. You can see a lot of the front end of it is just a mangled piece of metal. The impact of the crash caused severe damage to the building, but authorities tell us that the building uh, is safe. The station here has reopened. We also want to bring your attention to what's happening on the other side of k &A here in Kensington. There was a large police presence to an unrelated incident that happened just moments before noon today. We're told this is a double shooting here in Kensington. A, a woman was shot in the chest. A man was shot as well. So a large uh, response to this scene. Uh, we saw police just rushing to it moments before our noon live shot here. We're working to bring you more information. We'll have the latest starting on Eyewitness News at 4. For now, reporting live in Kensington, Matt Petrillo, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Matt. We'll go now.